quadruped um, terminal knee extension with a band, okay? So I want you to use that same band that you're using with your leg extensions. If we need to get another band, then I can give you the link to get another band, okay? But what we're gonna do is you're gonna use that same band and you're gonna put it behind one knee, okay? Just like how you would do it if you're standing doing the, the terminal knee extension. But from there, if you need a pad to just to initially get on the floor, use a pad, use a towel, okay? But you won't initially be on, on your knees too much, okay? From this position, I want you to kind of take up the slack because I want you to, to, to resist the extension, just like how you do it when you tie it around like a pole or around like a, a rig or something, right? This is essentially just to turn on your quad, okay? I'm just getting you in different positions. So from here, right, the band is behind my knee. I have some pretty good tension. That's why I took up the slack. From this position, you're going to hover so your your hands are underneath your shoulders, your knees are underneath your hips, like a like a like a bear position if you've ever heard that before. So from here you're going to just hover. I want you to rock your hips back, straighten that knee, and we're gonna hold the first one for 10 seconds. So I'm really squeezing my leg that has the band on it. So my left leg in this example, hold it 10 seconds, and then from there, we're going to do 12 repetitions continuously, squeezing that quad against the band. As you can see, as I do the repetitions, I'm not allowing my knees to touch the ground. I'm basically hovering over the ground as I go back to my starting position. So I'm hovering, pause, come back up, squeeze that thigh, and come back down. 